All right, ready? So, guys, these problems can really be broken down into, like, how well do we just know the cofunction identities? Remember, think about cotangent. Cotangent is just like what other graph? Tangent, right? So again, that's the idea of the cofunction identities. This is the same thing as tangent of x. The cosecant, that is odd or even. The only even functions are cosine and secant. So this is odd. So that means this can be rewrite, rewritten as negative cosecant of x. So we got to that part. But that really, I mean, all right, that didn't really help us, though. So now we got to determine, well, what kind of trigonometric identities are going to be most useful? And usually a rule of thumb, guys, is always look to simplify in terms of sines and cosines first. Yes? If you are stuck, yes. So if like would the next I, would the next step in the problem be like making like tan like sine over cosine? Yeah, and that's usually a good starting point. I would say usually to start there first, and if it doesn't help you out, then move on to the next one. And if I rewrote this as one as sine of x, and now I'm multiplying a fraction times a fraction. And what do we know about when we multiply fraction times fractions? You have everything separated by multiplication, so therefore we can apply the division property, and therefore this is just equal to negative secant of x. Um, um. Right? Is that a question? 